It's hard to believe it's time to start planning our fall wardrobe, even though the temperature doesn't say that quite yet. So here to give us a jump start on that is Ashley Inger with Her Majesty Boutique. Good morning, Ashley. Good morning. How Thanks are you? for joining us. Yes, thank you for having me. Okay, so I've been telling you guys that the majority of my wardrobe um, comes from this store, so I wanted to bring Ashley on and she's going to help us get ready for fall, show Absolutely. some great transition pieces. So yes. what do we need to look for as we head into fall trends and fall clothing? Um, deep, rich colors are always a go-to for fall. A lot of layering, of course, cute boots and booties, um, and some fall florals. We've really like started working that in. Um, also, for fall, of course, animal print is always a huge thing. Mm -hmm. We didn't bring our animal print, but we did bring a bunch of our new fall trendy items that you guys need to be looking for. All right, so tell us a little bit about what you're, what you're wearing first, because I was feeling it earlier. It's nice yes. velvet. <laughs> yes, velvet is a huge fall trend. I was actually worried last year as a buyer about whether velvet was a trend that was going to hang around. Right. And it really has come back this year full force, so velvet is a go for fall. So you mentioned as a buyer, how do you know when a trend is going to hang around for a few seasons or if it's going to be a one year and out type of deal? You don't. You so good luck. Yeah. <laughs> you, you trust your intuition, right? Yes. All right. So talk to me about what we have on the mannequins over here. Yes. Okay. Purple has been a huge color. It's actually the color of the year. So That's purple is a great go-to. Um, maxi dresses is pretty much what this outfit is representing. Mm -hmm. Huge trend for fall and actually all year round. We just change them up, and maxi dresses have just been really in style for the past few and years. And we have pockets. And pockets. Y'all know I'm a sucker for pockets if you're watching. So. Yes. Okay, so this material feels really light, though, so I feel like it would be a good mm -hmm. transition. It's not going to burn you up, but then you yes. can put maybe a cardigan with it for winter as well. Exactly. Yep, keep on wearing it. For our more petite girls, you can tie a knot in the bottom, and that makes it easy for you ladies to wear as well. Oh, perfect. All right, and then this black dress is a sweater, right? But it has yes. a cold shoulder. Yes, we have a sweater dress. Perfect for fall. Wear them with your boots. Throw on some leggings if you need to. And a gorgeous pearl layered necklace. And then, yes, the cold shoulder trend. Mm -hmm. You mentioned that. That has been huge for about two years now. Some people love it. Some people hate it. Personally, I love it. It just depends on how you feel about your shoulders. I'm personally glad it is sticking around. Because I, love I do love it. Yes, it just makes <laughs> things a little bit different. Gives so. you a little, you know, sometimes sweaters can be clunky, and this gives you a little bit of a femininity to it. Exactly. Okay, I now agree. you have brought some gorgeous ladies with you today that have yeah. some great fall outfits. I'll let you get started with them. Yeah, come out, first model. So our first model is wearing this gorgeous little tunic. Um, basically, what I wanted to represent with this is that one of the big colors for fall is going to be goldenrod. Um, mm -hmm. So other fall colors that you need to look for are, of course, purples, like I mentioned, burgundy, olive, mocha, rust. Those are all great fall colors, but this goldenrod and mustard shades are going to be huge for fall. I so love those one. colors. And, mm -hmm. and later in the show, we're going to be talking about some game day outfits for yes. football. And so this is a huge color for UT Chattanooga and yes. East Tennessee State University for any of those yes. girls, too. Yes, throw on the right color necklace and make it work for game day. Perfect. I love mm -hmm. it. Super comfy and perfect with some jeans. Love it. Yes. Easy right. outfit. Good to know. What, what do we have next? All right. Next, come on out. This one's going to represent two of our really big fall trends because cardigans are huge for mm -hmm. fall. She has on a cute little cardigan, but also stripes are a huge fall trend. And you're going to see the more subtle stripes that she has on, like the black and white. But another trend that has come in really hot and heavy that I was surprised by was really bright colored stripes and also um, pastel colored stripes on right. cardigans for the fall. So usually you think of deep, rich colors, but they're actually bringing in some really bright colors as well as pastels. So I'm okay, afraid of those. I'm okay with that trend. Now yes. I do say I noticed her necklace as soon as she was walking in. I love that necklace. Yes, Catch it's absolutely light. gorgeous. It's very different, but it's it's very subtle. I right. like big flashy jewelry. You well, may we're pageant be, girls. So. Yes, <laughs> pageant girls like the big and the flashy. And this is just really subtle, but also very pretty. It's a good so. way to marry the two. All yes, right. exactly. <laughs> All right, Thank perfect. You. And now talking about the florals, we mentioned right. florals are sticking around for fall. Fall florals are amazing. They make transitioning from summer into fall so easy, and they make it easy to wear your clothes longer. There are going to mm -hmm. be a few winter months where you're not going to want to pull this dress out of your closet, but right back in the spring, you can pull it right back out because Perfect. of the floral pattern. So, um, fall florals are huge. We absolutely love them. Don't be afraid. When I first started my boutique, I was so scared to buy florals in the fall. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. This um, doesn't feel that's right. That's a spring yeah. and summer thing. <laughs> I don't think this is right, but no, it's absolutely gorgeous. Throw on a pair of booties and boots with this, even a pair of leggings. It's mm -hmm. perfect. I think this would be so cute on a teacher oh, to would. school. It's adorable. That so. is perfect, and it's a great length, It's too. a great length for church, anything. Yes. All right. And keeping with the floral trend, this is a Thank dress I normally, the next model has a dress on. I normally would have thought about for summer only. 
But now that you have it yeah. paired with the right colors, yeah. I totally see it for fall. Yeah, and it's the embroidery is what makes it so fall. Embroidery is huge for fall. You're going to see a lot of that. And it makes you... It, it makes you able to wear the bright, pretty colors mm -hmm. with your fall wardrobe. So that is a great option. Anything with embroidery is a great option for fall. Oh, I love embroidery. All right, mm -hmm. now we're going to head to the denim. Seems like denim's been around for a couple yes. years now, but it's going to stay, it seems yes. like. Yes, denim. You, you'll see a lot of denim jumpsuits. And then the corduroy skirt also mm -hmm. is a great add-on for this outfit. I love the little fall mini skirts. This one's really cute. It's still a good length for our younger girls. Um, and then, of course, the chambray top. Denim is just... Huge. It's, right. it's going to stick around for fall. This is something that you can throw a little vest over and keep on wearing. It's just, it's an easy outfit. I love it. And I love the mm -hmm. length of that skirt. It's hard to find a skirt that style that's long enough. Yes. So I love it. You see a ton of the little corduroy skirts or the velvet skirts with the buttons down the front. This one has little pockets, so we love our pockets. So yeah, that's this outfit. All right, and we're going to go ahead and do a twofer on this one if we can have yes. the next two because it Both is similar out. styles but different as well. It is. So huge trend. What we wanted to talk about here is the knots in the front. That is huge. This waffle knit, I don't know how well you can see it on camera, but waffle knit is huge mm -hmm. for fall as well. Look at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> and then this actually unbuttons. We're not going to unbutton it, but it can be a cardigan as well. So you can well. just leave it loose too. Mm -hmm. You can. Yeah. I love it. And then the sweater or the shirt on the other side is a little bit of a different material, so still lends itself to fall. Also but. has this really cute bell sleeve. So. Who doesn't love a good bell sleeve with a ruffle? Exactly. I know. All right. Thank you, ladies. And last look for fall. This Vest. is something I would wear every day. You yes. would see me living in this outfit. Vests, of course, are a huge trend for fall, but what we really wanted to point out with this outfit was the Sherpa. The color. Of course. And the, the color, Sherpa. too. I know. The Sherpa is amazing. Um, we start getting them about this time of year. I'm going to feel you, form. okay? I'm just yes. <laughs> so soft and still so, so flattering. I mean, she has on this layer and still looks tiny. So, yes. you know, it doesn't add on, but. It's beautiful. You'll see them in half zips. You'll see them in full zip mm -hmm. jackets for the winter. So this is just a great transition into winter. Yay! All right, so that's our fall outfits. Thank you, ladies. We are going to be back towards the end of the show with a look at all outfits for game day. Uh, real quick, where can we shop you online? You can shop on Instagram at Shop Her Majesty, and you can shop on Facebook. Just search for us under Her Majesty Boutique. All right, Ashley, we're going to talk to you in a little bit about some football fashion. But for right now, stick around on Let's Chat.